Next is a gimbal expansion joint. This is very similar to your hinged expansion joint. It's a single bellows, but this one's designed to permit angular rotation in any plane by using two pairs of hinges that are affixed to a common floating gimbal ring. Like the hinge expansion joint, the gimbal ring, the hinges, and the pins have to be designed to restrain pressure thrust. And gimbal expansion joints should be used in sets of two or three as well, or with in combination with a hinge joint. And again, like the hinge joints, when used in pairs, the amount of lateral deflection that can be absorbed is proportional to the distance between the two joints. So again, in here now, we see now we have both bending stiffnesses released. So again, coming back to the auto pipe model, if we open the gimbal expansion joint model, this is going to look very similar because the configuration is the same, the joint is the same, but we're just releasing two bending stiffness directions, both of them now instead. And if we run the analysis and take a look at our displacements, you can kind of see that, but when you look at the actual values of the displacements, again, vertically, the pipe as a whole is moving down, but the expansion joints are not contracting or expanding. We have uh, maybe about 0.3 inches in the X direction and about 0.2, 0.3 inches in the Z direction. So now it's using both planes to take into account the growth in the two directions rather than just the one plane with the hinge joint.